We continue now to follow that breaking news in Farmington Hills. We've been telling you about where a police officer is now facing child pornography charges. Jermont Terry is live outside the Farmington Hills Police Department. And Jermont, what have you learned tonight about the officer? Sandra, we know the officer is identified as Matthew Parsons. He spent the past 25 years serving the community here in Farmington Hills. But tonight, his gun and badge turned in. He's suspended without pay and stands accused of downloading several images of child pornography. This is how people in Farmington Hills may know Officer Matthew Parsons. But now the 48-year-old wears an orange jumpsuit, accused of downloading at least 10 videos of child pornography. The, the story itself has has tarnished the badge. Um, what we're doing here is the men and women are professional in this department and uh, they will wipe off that mark on their badge and they will carry on. Investigators from the Attorney General Office came to the Farmington Hills Police Department late last week to serve a warrant. It, it does feel uh, odd to have investigators come into the department doing an investigation here. but it Police Chief Charles Nebus says they searched Parsons' personal cell phone, computer devices, and car at the police station and his home. I asked the chief if Officer Parsons is accused of watching the videos while on patrol on the taxpayer's dime. I don't think so, to the best of my knowledge. The chief stresses Parsons only worked in patrol, never at the schools. For uh, an assignment he held where he would have exclusively been around children or kids, and this news that we received was a stunning shock to, to all of us. The chief says this case serves as a reminder no one is above the law, even online. They're going to get you. you know, they're going to catch you. You're going to leave a trail. You're leaving crumbs, and you're going to get caught. And it doesn't matter if you're a police officer or what you are or, or what you do. So far, it doesn't appear that any of the work computers here at the police department were used, but we should point out that this is still an open investigation. The chief stressing to the community tonight that what this officer is accused of doing does not reflect to his department and the fine work that they do here. Reporting live tonight outside the Farmerson Hills Police Department, Jermont Terry, Local 4.